Hey YouTube, Hack97 here. I'm gonna be showing you how to get WhatsApp on your iPod Touch or iPad, which works properly. It's quite simple on the iPhone, as you can just go and install it and install WhatsApp. For the iPod Touch and iPad, there's some procedures which you have to follow. Okay, I am running in an iPod Touch, you can tell by the slimness and the camera. And I am on version 5.0.1. You can see version 5.0.1. Okay, after this, you should go to WhatsApp. I mean, sorry about that. You should go and install this and search for WhatsApp. So, after you search that, down the first one. I'm not doing that as I don't have any net, net connection right, right now. It's early in the morning, so it's not on. So search WhatsApp, install the first one. And then after you install WhatsApp, enter WhatsApp. It'll give you a message saying that sorry, it's not supporting you on your i device. Ignore that message. Come out. And double tap your home button, hold WhatsApp, and exit it from your multitasking menu. You have to do that if you want this to work. Then next, you go to Syria. Okay, so you should go to search. I've got my internet connection now, so you can search for what's bad. P A D. What's bad? Search that. Sorry about that. And download the first one, which is from the Big Boss repo. Don't worry, it says it's only for the iPad, but it's same for the iPod Touch. And you also say install as mine says modify as I've already installed it. So once you have installed WhatsApp, <coughs> go back to WhatsApp. Remember, you must have exited this from the multitasking menu. It'll ask you to fill out the information which country you are from, your phone number. Uh, they'll send you an SMS for your confirmation code. You type in the confirmation code and it's done. WhatsApp is activated. Okay, guys, that's about it. I don't think I have anything else. Yeah, so please like, comment, and subscribe. Okay, guys, have a nice time signing off.